Thank you guys so much for the show. Thank you very much. What a crowd. Everyone excited about the undertones. We're going to play a few tunes for you, so get ready to jump along.
it's going to be our last song for tonight, The Crying Machine. It's going to get you going, get you really happy, and check out Undertones. We've got a merch table out the back if you want to have a look and get some t-shirts or some EPs or something like that. So enjoy. Undertones sounds very ominous and dark, but uh, but uh, really fun. Lots of energy, obviously. Uh, you don't need me to tell you that. That was great. Um, I uh, would have liked to have seen everybody shine. You all did in your own way, but um, really great sounds from the bass player awesome tone at that last song it's like you had overdrive on board or something i don't know how you did it um and the keyboard player great sounds so 
and really tight rhythm section and and you had a work ethic in the rhythm section which i always love hearing because it's um even though you don't get credit for it i'm giving you credit right here um guitar person you are really great at what you're doing and i'm sure you know that your rhythm section are hot as well i'm sure you know that um i just uh was just thinking yeah and you main you all maintained your energy throughout that's why it was a very upbeat thing um that's why the name of your band is kind of it's a bit interesting it's good that it's a dark name but then you come on stage and get everybody going um for that sort of music that's that's saying something too um so yeah look um uh, or like, and maybe a bit more in audience interaction and interaction between you all with each other. The way you're presenting that style of music, it's fun. And you can take that even further, I think, with each other and have more fun with each other. Um, it's, it's good to be... I like seeing a band that's lighthearted but absolute shredders at what they do. Like, I love seeing that, where they're kind of like... Eh, you know, we're just having fun here. It's kind of easy going, but then they're absolute shredders. I think you're on that road, and I think you should take it to that next level. Um, yeah, and I just loved all the sounds and the tones. It was all really great. Um, I think you could take that style of music to a whole new audience that wouldn't otherwise listen to it. So good on you. Over to Tim. Not a hell of a lot more to add to that i thought you were fantastic i really enjoyed the show it was fun um lead guitar man you're amazing like really great stage presence um fantastic skills and um really great to see someone attacking the guitar like that i just i really loved that i got excited by that um and I, the only thing i could say that i picked for you to improve on is your transition between finger picking and guitar picking was a little bit rough a couple of times when you did it um and that's just one thing for you to work on um far from me to give you any criticisms on uh, criticisms on guitar because you're uh, way better than me but um anyway i picked up on that um bass and drums i i loved the feel between the bass and the drums and i just thought as ed said that you could maybe have a little bit more visual contact with each other and sort of be getting into the groove together because you're that that motor room for the for the band um you're the engine room and to see a, i love to see a bass player and a drummer really feeding off each other and giving each other visual cues and and just having that kind of fun interaction on stage and i think you guys could do that really well um, fantastic skills, both of you, and keyboards. Um, the same. You kind of, keyboard. You're you're kind of in the rhythm section too, in that kind of a scenario that we saw today. I'd definitely like to see all of you doing more. Um, if you're going to keep going with that style of band, which is instrumental, to have moments, as Ed said, for every member to have a bit of a solo or, or to have their moment to shine and just show up your chops because you're all great. Um, I, think, I think that's all I've got to say. Yeah. I just want to add one last thing to that. It's um, it is a thing when with instrumental bands, you can afford to go a bit more crazy with the theatrics, mm. even dare I say it, costume. I mean, not overboard, but whatever, whatever floats your boat, really. Um, and if you have access to this kind of resource, staging, lights, even the humble smoke machine. It sounds cheesy, but it just there's a reason it's still used. <laughs> <laughs> um, all those things would add to it to what is, is already a very solid unit a very solid bunch of people playing music so good on you all and again rhythm section ripper thanks <laughs>